6 RX uh, 580s MSI uh, 4 gigabyte cards. Uh, uh, what issues did we face and uh, what, we do, what did we do to uh, sort out this problem and get, and get 6 cards working? Hey guys, uh, welcome back to our channel and uh, uh, today uh, we will be setting up a, a 6 uh, RX 580s 4 GB cards and uh, we faced some issues to uh, uh, start mining on Windows and on ETHOS but we got finally working that on simple uh, mining software which, it's, which is uh, Linux based and uh, we got all 6 cards uh, mining at uh, 172 mega hashes they are uh, modified so what was happening that uh, when we tried to boot six cards on Windows the Windows wasn't booted we think there is a big issue with the drivers because these cards are still uh, still very new and uh, and uh, they have uh, issues with the drivers and what we did was uh, uh, we uh, uh, booted the windows with four cards and then we modified those four cards and then we connected the uh, next two cards uh, and uh, modified uh, them also and after that we uh, uh, launched all six cards on the simple mining uh, software and we are mining ethereum at the moment so i will show you what setup we use These are six MSI uh, RX 580s, four gigabyte cards. On a stock, they come with a uh, 1380 uh, uh, megahertz core clock. We haven't tested them on, yet on the Zcash, but uh, these cards should be good on the Zcash mining as well. There's, there's not much difference. There's nearly not any difference on the uh, uh, mining Ethereum from the uh, RX 480 series and uh, they are uh, they probably nearly the same uh, as uh, RX 480s they just use a bit more power as you can see uh, this mining rig is going at 1200 watts from the wall so yeah uh, for like for uh, uh, RX 4 uh, 80s 4 gigabyte cards on Windows, we were getting about 900 watts only, but uh, that's because because we were undervolting the core. And uh, on this so software, I'm not really sure if you can do it. You know, it's first time I'm using it, but uh, the only software I got success to uh, boot all six cards. We are using a Biostar TB85 motherboard and uh, a 1200 uh, Superflower uh, power supply and also Intel CPU G1840 uh, 8 gigabytes of RAM and uh, just a normal SSD card so yeah these cards are uh, Hynix memory and uh, what we did for modify use the same modify as on the uh, 400 series cards we copied the 1500 uh, straps into the uh, lower ones to uh, 1625 1750 and 2000 and we got this result for uh, mining and it's mining stable now and uh, yeah the, the the memory on these cards is set for 2000 and the core is uh, 1100 so yeah that's what we did with these cards and uh, they are working now. That's the main thing. And we will wait for uh, Windows, uh, for AMD to release the newer version dri drivers. And uh, we hope that we will set up on the Windows also these. And uh, 
If you get succeeded, uh, we will be back with a new video. If you haven't subscribed yet my channel, do that now. If you like this video, thumbs up. If you didn't like, thumbs down. And I'll see you on the next video. Thank you.